alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh Hi guys, how are you? Samantha Tabuk, International Schools And we study science together Today, inshallah, we're gonna talk about uh, chapter 2 This is chapter 2 and lesson 1, session 1 What are the parts of plants? Again, parts of plants so let's watch this video together to know more about plants and its parts. Plants need air and water to live and grow. They also need nutrients. A nutrient is any food material that a living thing needs to grow. Plants have parts. The parts of a plant. Okay, guys, let's stop here with nutrients. Nutrient. What the meaning of nutrients? It's food materials the plant take it from soil okay again uh, food materials nutrients is food material okay again nutrients or food materials the plant take it from soil okay plant need nutrients to grow excellent to grow and change okay so let's continue Plants have parts. The parts of a plant help it get what it needs. Roots grow down into the soil. Roots hold the plant in the soil. Roots carry nutrients and water from the soil to the plant's stem. The stem carries the nutrients and water to the leaves. It also keeps the plant upright. Green leaves use sunlight, air, water, and nutrients to make food for the plant. Some plants have flowers. Flowers make seeds. Most plants are what we call seed plants. Okay, guys. So we're gonna complete this video next session, inshallah. Let's back to the book page 76. Look with me at this picture. You can see stones and rocks. What is this green thing? Okay. The those are leaves of plant okay so this is plant and this is plant okay the objects in the picture are lithops those are lithops and we can call uh, this plant living stones again living stones why because it look like stones okay and the animal think they are stones and not food so the animal don't eat it subhanallah okay so lithops can live in very hot and dry places why because of their shape how they can store a lot of water in their thick leaves so those leaves are thick and the plants store water in it on it so guys let's write how the lithops shape help them live in hot dry places can you help? Yeah, they can store a lot of water in their thick leaves. Super. Okay, so let's watch this uh, song together to know more about the needs of plant. Okay, so now we know that five needs of plants and we have nutrients, so those are six needs of plants. Okay, if we look at the book page 77, you're gonna find plants needs. Again, plants needs. Okay, 
Okay? We said plants need water, air to live and grow. Plants need sunlight and space to grow and nutrients. Okay? Nutrients. Nutrients is food materials that living things need to live and grow. So we need nutrients too. We can take nutrients from uh, food like milk, okay, cheese, meat. Okay. So most plants can grow well if they get the right amount of everything. What's the meaning of this? If we, you give a plant a lot of water, Okay, the plant will die. Why? Because it needs just the right amount of water. Okay, so if we put uh, the plant in very hot sun, the plant might die too. Why? Because it needs just the right amount of sunlight. So the plant must take the right amount of everything they need. So guys, let's look together at this nice picture. The plant is getting water and sunlight. What will happen next? Mm, come on, think with me. The plant will grow. Good job. Okay, so let's watch this uh, nice video to know more about nutrients. Okay. So guys, as you see, those are nutrients in plant. Take nutrients from the soil, okay? So, no words time. First word, mm, do you remember? This is plant. It's living stones. We call it lithops. Good job. Okay. Those, those are food materials that living things need to live and grow. The plant can take it from soil. So those are nutrients. Good job again. Nutrients. Super guys. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Inshallah. Bye.